there was a lot of notable country music uh, musicians, both performers and songwriters, who died in 2015. And um, it's not that I only want to do country songs, but I think I'm going to stick mostly with country songs this week because um, they probably won't be very well represented otherwise. So, because I know everybody likes to do rock music. Even though I saw Linda has already done one by Gene Ritchie, so I don't have to do that one. <clears throat> and I did one of her songs recently, a couple of seasons ago, um, uh, The Ellen Inn Don't Stop Here Anymore. That's probably her most famous song. Anyway, this is my new ukulele. <clears throat> Still got the uh, aquila strings on it, which I'm undoubtedly going to change. I don't have anything against this brand. I just don't like nylon strings. I'm going to put fluorocarbons on them. <clears throat> anyway, here's my first offering. This is a song I've played before. I'll probably screw it up somewhere. Did you ever sleep at the foot of the bed when the weather was whizzing cold? When the wind was whistling around the house and the moon was yellow as gold? You give your good warm mattress up to a Lizzie and Uncle Fred. Too many kin folks on a bad night and you went to the foot of the bed. Well, I could always wait till the old folks ate and leave the leavings with grace. The teacher could keep me after school and I'd still have a smile on my face. But I could wear the big boy's worn out clothes or let sister have my sled. But it always did get my nanny go to sleep at the foot of the bed. It was fine enough when kinfolks come and the kids brought brand new games. You could see how fat all the old folks was and learn all the babies' names. We had biscuits and custard and chicken pie. We all got Sunday fed. But I know darn well when night time come, I was headed for the foot of the bed. Say some folks don't know what it is having company all over the place. To wrestle for a cover on a winter night with a big foot setting in your face. Her cold toenails are scratching your back and the footboard scrubbing your head. I'll tell the world you ain't lost a thing, never sleeping at the foot of the bed. Well, I've done it over and over again in this land of the brave and the free. And in this all fired battle of life, it's left its mark on me. For I'm always a struggling around at the foot instead of forging ahead. And I don't think it's caused from a doggone thing but sleeping at the foot of the bed. No, I don't think it's caused from a doggone thing but sleeping at the foot of the bed. Little Jimmy Dickens.